now, Mom. Welcome to Louisiana. Hi, in this video, I'll show you Louisiana, Pelican State. Cajun or Creole. You Cajun know, and Creole. In that, okay. it, but, uh, and sometimes it's hard to understand a few words they say, but oh, mostly you, you can understand what they say. Oh, okay. Louisiana. Where would you recommend tourists to go? Most people like to go to New Orleans, to the French Quarter, and that is uh, the oldest part of New Orleans. Uh, it's got lots of history of, of the Creole and Cajuns. Okay, mm -hmm. and it's over here? Mm -hmm. oh, over here, New Orleans. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Before the European settlers, it was settled by the Natchez and the Choctaw tribe. If you want to learn more about them, the Ogden Museum has cool art. Europeans came to Louisiana because of the importance of the Mississippi River. It was settled by the Spanish, then the French and the Americans. They also brought their language and culture, but throughout time, it became mixed with other race. Beignets are a popular breakfast here in Louisiana. You should try it. Okay, so I'm here in Louisiana about to try Café Au Lait, uh, which is a French coffee. Mmm, good for the mornings. And the beignet. You see all the powder? It's really soft and warm. Look at that. Ooh, the powder. You guys should give this a try. Mm. This is your go to morning coffee and beignet. I'm dipping. <laughs> Congo Square, Louisiana. So right behind me is where slaves gathered and played music. They brought their voodoo and fortune telling culture here if anyone's interested. Okay, so back here in Louisiana, I'm about to try gumbo. So right here, here's the gumbo. Uh, the itu thing. You dip the bread inside the itu thing and give it a bite. You get that mixture of uh, flavors inside here. It's like uh, West African. Food. And here's the jambalaya, a mixture of everything. So you have the sausage, you have the shrimp, the rice, all the spices inside this. And let's give it a bite. Gumbo from Louisiana. Here's the sausages and the rice. In the 1700s, the first Asians came to Louisiana. They were called the Manila Men, where they worked as fishermen. Filipino Fiesta. Here you have the squid, the inasal, the tilapia with yempo, and Shanghai rolls. And you have the pancit. In the 1920s, the po' boy sandwich was invented. The most popular is the shrimp po' boy for under seven dollars.
World War II museum gives you the experience of how soldiers live in the 1940s. And if you like hot sauce, Tabasco was founded here in Louisiana. You can do the tour for $5 and they give you sample bottle. It's a magical concoction that's more than just heat. Tabasco blends with cheese and all your toppings and meat. Shake, 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 shake. Others must the flavor. This whole sample flies our tune. Make sure you try Tabasco on your pizza real soon. So much more than hot. Louisiana. Probably my cooking. I love the flavors that come out of here. Have you tasted my cooking? Have you tasted Popeye's sweet meat butterfly shrimp? They start out a little sweet with my shortbread flavor, then comes a little heat. You bread spicy shrimp and sweet shortbread? I do. You can grab eight shrimp plus a side and a biscuit for just five bucks, or mix in some tenders with my surf and turf. You are good, Annie. Not half as good as my shrimp. In Louisiana, there's also a big Vietnamese community because of the French culture and the weather. You should try their pho and their crawfish. It's good with rice. It's as flavorful as it is functional. Each ingredient chosen carefully. Every blend crafted masterfully to help you persevere and power through daily diligently, deliberately, and with intent. Sustaining your body, whatever you may do. Supporting your mind, wherever you may go. Nurturing your passion, nourishing your purpose. So you can be your best self. Some people want the recipe for our delicious cane sauce, but we'll take the secret to our graves. You know, our founder, Todd Graves. He's the guy who figured out which blend of spices makes every drop of sauce totally tasty. Of course, it helps that our cane sauce is made fresh every single day, no matter what. And Todd's also the guy who won't spill a secret recipe. But you can definitely it all you like. Raising Cane's, one love. Another popular Louisiana drink is the daiquiris. Louisiana with a daiquiri. In Louisiana, you have to be careful with the scammers. They ask you about your shoe and ask you a joke. And if they get it right, you have to give them $5 or some scam. With French cultural influences, many French Canadians visit here. Regardless of the heartbreaks and hurricanes, if you like seafood and fun people, you should visit Louisiana.
Beignets and smoothie are good souvenirs to remember your trip in Louisiana. Thanks for watching the video. Please like and subscribe for more travel content. Thank you and have a great day.